Police officer hurt in petrol bomb attack in Birmingham. A police officer is being treated for burns after a petrol bomb was thrown at him in Birmingham. West Midlands police said they were called to a property in Onbury Road, Hansworth, shortly before 5.30 BST following reports of a dispute. Why do we see so much crime and violence in the world today? Will there ever be an end to crime and violence? But it did not prevail, neither was a place found for them any longer in heaven. Nine so down the great dragon was hurled, the original serpent, the one called Devil and Satan, who is misleading the entire inhabited earth, he was hurled down to the earth, and his angels were hurled down with him. Revelation chapter 12 verses 8 and 9 Many people blame God for what happens in the world today. They think that God must be cruel or heartless to allow this to carry on. What do you think? And Jehovah felt regrets that he had made men in the earth, and he felt hurt at his heart. Genesis chapter 6 verse 6 We learn here that God feels deeply about the misconduct of others. He hates wickedness. However, it is not God who causes wickedness but man. James chapter 1 verse 13 reads when under trial, let no one say, I am being tried by God. For with evil things God cannot be tried nor does he himself try anyone. The Bible foretells the attitudes of people in this time period that accurately describes why the petrol bomb attack should occur. 2 Timothy chapter 3 verses 1 through 5 reads but know this, that in the last days critical times hard to deal with will be here. 2 for men will be lovers of themselves, lovers of money, self-assuming, haughty, blasphemers, disobedient to parents, unthankful, disloyal, three having no natural affection, not open to any agreement, slanderers, without self-control, fierce, without love of goodness, four be traitors, headstrong, puffed up with pride lovers of pleasures rather than lovers of God, five having a form of godly devotion but proving false to its power, and from these turn away. Is this not like reading a newspaper report today? Isaiah chapter 65 verse 17 describes what God intends to do about it. For here I am creating new heavens and a new earth, and the former things will not be called to mind, neither will they come up into the heart. Why has he not formed the new world already? Well, for one reason, God does not want anyone to be destroyed but to repent and gain everlasting life. In Matthew 24 verse 14 we find out why God has allowed time for people to come to know him. And this good news of the kingdom will be preached in all the inhabited earth for a witness to all the nations, and then the end will come. So we learn here that the good news about God and his kingdom has to be preached first. Only after this disciple-making work will God then step in and remove the wickedness from the earth causing the end to come. There will be no more crime, violence and immorality, but peaceful humans will live on earth in a paradise just as God first intended before Adam and Eve's disobedience. Genesis 1 verse 28 reads, Further, God blessed them and God said to them, Be fruitful and become many and fill the earth and subdue it, and having subjection the fish of the sea and the flying creatures of the heavens and every living creature that is moving upon the earth. If you would like to find out more about the Bible, please navigate your browser to jw.org. Thank you for playing this video.